The Turkish made TIKN, also known as TF or MMU, is quickly emerging as a serious competitor to the US F 35, particularly with its advanced capabilities, stealth design, and cutting edge technologies. Developed by Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, with contributions from BE Systems and other defense giants like Roketsin and Aselsan, the KAN is shaping up to challenge Western made fifth generation fighters' dominance in capability and cost effectiveness. Its design focuses heavily on air superiority, multi-role flexibility, and stealth, and it has the potential to reshape not only the Turkish Air Force's future, but also the global fighter jet market. The development of the KN fighter jet, originally known as the TFX, Turkish Fighter Experimental, officially began in 2011 under a program initiated by Turkey's Undersecretariat for Defense Industries, SS. The TFX program was launched as part of Turkey's strategic plan to reduce reliance on foreign military aircraft and establish a robust domestic defense industry capable of producing advanced technologies, including a fifth-generation stealth fighter. In 2015, Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, was awarded the contract to develop the fighter, with BAE Systems providing technical expertise in advanced design and systems integration. The initial years of development focused on research, conceptual design, and the early phases of engineering, including the development of avionics, stealth materials, and propulsion systems. By 2018, the program had progressed to more advanced prototyping, with plans for the first prototype scheduled to take flight in 2025. The jet's radar-absorbing materials, RAM, have been subjected to extensive testing, with reports indicating they provide superior stealth capabilities compared to the F-35's coating. Additionally, the aircraft has undergone wind tunnel tests to refine its aerodynamics and ensure its performance at high speeds. As of 2024, the KN is in its prototyping phase, with Turkey having completed successful ground tests for key components such as the airframe, engine integration, and avionics. Testing is ongoing, and further evaluations are expected to focus on sensor fusion, combat systems, and maneuverability. The KAN remains on track to make its maiden flight in 2025, with plans to enter service in the mid-2020s. Turkey's continued progress in this program positions the KAN as a serious competitor to the F-35, with the added benefit of being entirely domestically produced, providing self-sufficiency in defense technology. On October 15, 2024, a significant development underscored the Khan's rising international appeal. Saudi Arabia, a major player in the Middle East, expressed interest in acquiring over 100 KN fighter jets. This potential deal was highlighted during a visit by Saudi Air Force Commander Turkey bin Bandar al Saad to Turkey, where he met with senior officials from Roketsin, TEI, and Aselsan. During the visit, Saudi officials were given in-depth briefings on the Khan's capabilities, and discussions were initiated regarding potential strategic collaboration in the area of fifth-generation fighter technology. The Saudi interest adds to the growing recognition of the KAN as a viable alternative to other advanced fighters, including the F-35. The KAN fighter jet features advanced stealth technology, superior radar-absorbing materials, twin-engine propulsion, and cutting-edge avionics designed for air superiority and next-gen combat missions. In terms of combat capabilities, the KN is designed to offer superior maneuverability, stealth, and sensor integration. It is equipped with advanced radar-absorbing materials, RAM, that are reportedly up to 10 times more effective than the F-35 stealth coating, which can degrade in harsh environments. The Khan's AI-assisted avionics and sensor fusion make it an ideal candidate for both air-to-air -air combat and precision strikes in highly contested environments. This is where it directly competes with the F-35, a multi-role fighter used for a variety of missions, from ISR and EW to deep strike. While the F-35 excels in versatility, the KN is focused more on superior maneuverability and air-to-air -air combat, which could make it a preferred choice for nations looking for a dedicated air superiority platform. The KAN is also equipped with cutting-edge AI and autonomy, allowing it to operate in increasingly complex combat environments, including coordinating with loyal wingman drones. This enhances its ability to perform in high-threat scenarios, where human pilots may be overwhelmed by the sheer volume of data and decision-making required. In contrast, while the F-35 has advanced sensor fusion that gives pilots superior situational awareness, 
the Khan's autonomous features offer an additional layer of combat efficiency, providing an edge in environments where traditional human decision-making might lag. In terms of payload capacity, the F-35 can carry around 2,000 pounds of munitions in its internal weapons bays and up to 18,000 pounds externally. The KAN is expected to have a similar payload capacity, with the ability to carry both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground munitions, including indigenous Turkish-made missiles such as the Goktagan, long-range air-to-air missile, and Bosdagan, short-range air-to-air missile. Its internal weapons bay and stealth features ensure that it can carry these munitions without compromising its low radar profile. One of the standout features of the KEN is its engine, which is expected to provide up to 38,000 pounds of thrust, enabling the jet to reach speeds of Mach 1.8, faster than the F-35's top speed of Mach 1.6. This gives the KEN an edge in terms of speed and agility, vital traits in air-to-air -air combat. The jet's aerodynamic design, combined with state-of-the-art avionics and stealth materials, make it a formidable competitor to the F-35 in future conflicts, particularly in scenarios requiring rapid maneuvering and interception of enemy aircraft. The growing Saudi interest in the KEN, along with Turkey's active role in developing and producing next-generation fighter technologies, could make the KEN a game-changer in the international fighter jet market. As Turkey seeks to position itself as a leader in the development and export of fifth-generation aircraft, the Khan's potential to rival the F-35 becomes more evident. This shift in demand could significantly impact Western defense exporters, as countries like Saudi Arabia, who have previously relied on U.S. military hardware, look toward Turkey for more cost-effective and advanced solutions. In conclusion, the KN is emerging as a strong contender to the F-35. With its advanced stealth capabilities, AI-enhanced systems, superior maneuverability, and increasing international interest, it could reshape the global fighter aircraft landscape. As Turkey continues to refine and test the KAN, it is positioning itself not only as a competitor to U.S. fighters like the F-35, but also as a key player in the global defense export market, poised to rival established players in the industry.